how we can perform the slicing operation with the list elements so here this is the list object which will consider a string we have the string in float and boolean type so i want to first find out the length of that list so this is advanced concept in a python slicing operation so length is 5 so i want to get the certain range of elements okay i want to get 0 to 3 so what are those elements indexing will start from 0 that is 0 1 2 so length minus 1 okay 0 to 2 you will get what is this abc hr 23 see this is how the advanced topics in uh, slicing operation suppose i want to get with the help of minus minus will start from 0 1 2 3 4 5 right i mean 0 till 5 minus 5 is abc minus 4 is hr minus 3 is uh, 23 likewise you can uh, count it and you can see this diagram if you don't understand this so based uh, this is only forward direction if you provide the backward direction you will get the space as an answer okay so i want i'm trying to get minus 0 1 2 3 4 okay 5 minus 5 colon minus 1 what is the value you will get all the values except true okay <coughs> So these are the slicing operation in Python. So that is more flexibility when you uh, go with the data science level. This is a more advanced topic and you can do with. Uh, so I want to get one more range 0 to 3. Already provide 0 to 4 I am getting. So this is the slicing which you will perform slicing operation in Python. This is uh, very very useful and it is important concept in the Python slicing operations. I want to get minus 3 colon minus 2 so what is this 23 only single value suppose I want to get 0 to 3 0 to 2 2 values and one more LST of minus 3 minus 2 okay we will get only one value again so if you provide backward direction suppose uh, I have HR and ABC right HR is minus 5 and 4 is uh, hr okay i want to give minus 4 and minus 4 you will get the space as answer see empty so when you provide the backward direction you will get the empty as answer that is space only space nothing else so this is how you can perform the slicing operation if if you have any comments you can provide in 